mic so the audio should be extremely better let me turn this off you guys hi <clears throat> i am gonna quickly make some coffee before i start a work not the light we love some good lighting this isn't even good this is just kind of exposed why i look so washed out ew good morning hello um my camera died in the gym what's new every single time i try to record in there it's either i'm on my crappy quality iphone or i my camera dies so clearly i'm not meant to record my workouts i'm making some coffee before i start work as I do. <laughs> Zoe, I'm gonna call you out for your comment where, so I got a comment and girl was just like, why are you always reminding us that you work? I'm like, bitch, cause I do. <laughs> I don't know. I am weird. I even when I'm editing the video, I'm just like, why won't I shut up? Like, why can't I shut up? Why am I saying I work? Obviously, I work. What else do I do um, from nine to five? But so, yeah, we're going to attempt another day in the life of vlog. Usually what happens when I try to do these videos, I end up falling into work like real deep and just not vlogging. But we'll attempt anyways, because why not? You know, <laughs> a lot of preparation today. I need to wash my hair. I say that every week because, you know, I wash my hair weekly and every week when i say oh i really need to wash my hair i never really end up washing my hair till i get to like back home or my friend's house and then i'm rushing it but i really want to deep condition my hair because i haven't done that in a really long time so yeah <clears throat> let's make some quaffs It is so cold in my apartment. I am here looking like a whole ass snack, but like a wrap, <laughs> like a snack wrap. I, I don't know like, well, I know why it's cold in here. Let me show you guys. Okay, so in my kitchen, there's like this vent that pulls air from outside this it like pulls in all this cold air and it obviously just brings it into the living room and I'm over it. I'm so over it. It's so cold. On top of the fact that my gym also opens really late and closes really early, I want to be a Karen and just like email my apartment managers, whoever, and just say, yo, can you, can y'all like fix this situation? Cause we also have outlets that aren't working. Should I be a Karen? Yeah. Yeah, I'm gonna do it but after work, but it's cold. Not my brightest moment, but mm. I washed my hair earlier and I'm gonna rinse it out right now. My hair has grown so much. I wish I took care of it more when it's in braids. Like I, I don't really moisturize it as much as I would. And I know that would prevent a lot of the breakage I get when I take my braids out. But regardless, um, yeah, my hair has been, I have like a plastic bag <laughs> on my head because I'm like, I didn't have like a shower. I didn't have a shower cap. So I needed something to hold in heat. It's one o'clock. I have a meeting at two. Why is my voice cracking up? And so I'm going to quickly rinse my hair out because I just sent off the big project task that I had to do for work today. So yeah, I'm just going to take a sec, rinse it, wash it out. And I need to go eat after that before my meeting because I don't know why I haven't been eating as much. That's not me. Oh my God. Oh, sorry. I, I'm using a mic now. So if the mic's plugged in but not on, this is a cord, it will like chip out the whole audio. Let me close my ball that. So I was scared that nothing was being recorded. All right, let's go. So yeah, that's pretty much all I do for my hair. Just keep it simple, you know? It's been interesting learning more about my hair because I've never really had to do my hair growing up. My mom always did it for me. Then it was relaxed early. So, you know, it was just easier to manage. And then now it's mad expensive to deal with my hair up here. So gotta learn to do that shit myself. 
I should actually just put my hair in some braids right now. I even need to learn to braid my hair properly, especially since I don't need to blow dry it anymore. That's just an easier way for it to air dry probably, huh? It is time for my lunch slash breakfast slash pre-dinner because it's not really dinner. It's four o'clock. Um, I'm gonna make ramen, keep it simple. Not even like the nice kind of noodles. <laughs> Mr. Frickin' Noodles. Cheers. Okay, so I kind of want to give you guys just an update on what's going on for today. So it's Thursday. The work day is basically done. I have like half an hour of work left to do like how much time I have left to do. Um, but I'm stopping to eat and yeah, anyways. I am gonna go do my nails after work. I know I've been saying this in every vlog. Oh, I want to do my nails. Oh, I need to do my nails. I'm actually doing them today. I'm so excited. I, <laughs> I just feel so relieved and so excited that I can finally do this. So yeah, I'm gonna walk to the nail salon, nail spa nail salon <laughs> after work i don't even know what color i want to do because here's the thing so this weekend is perita's birthday and i actually ordered a dress for her birthday party i'll insert here but the dress did not come on time which is also my fault because i ordered it last minute but it should have been here from wednesday which is yesterday and it's not even in canada so i need to go buy a dress the only thing is i don't know if i'm gonna have time to get my nails done and get the dress just because the mall closes at eight and the nail place like i'm not gonna get there till after five when I'm done work so yeah yeah so I'm thinking I'm gonna go do my nails and maybe I'll deal with the mall situation when I'm home like go to the mall like near my mom's house or something it's just easier it kind of just makes more sense and stuff but the reason I want to do my nails today is because tomorrow I'm going to like some polar winter festival thing with one of my friends so I'm actually heading back home to Toronto tomorrow so I need to buy a bus ticket. Um, I'm gonna be waking up at 6 a.m. Mm, I hope I get, well, I'm not waking up at six. I need to get there at six, which is disgusting, but that's what we're gonna have to do. Um, I also have my personal assessment tomorrow, which I'm so excited for because I've been really hard on myself throughout this whole term and I saw like the start of my, how your PA works is like, they will send it to you and then we meet to discuss. And it's actually really good. So I sit here complaining about, oh my God, like I, I suck at my job and this and that, and I'm doing well. <laughs> so I'm proud. I'm proud of myself. I hope everyone's proud of themselves. What have you guys accomplished this week? Um, yeah, I'm just proud of myself. So, oh. And now I can get my nails done. I have my hair washed. It ain't looking that cute right now, but you know, it's clean. <laughs> so that's step one. Anyways, so that's what's going on. I'm gonna eat this, finish up work, and then we are gonna head out. I really want to do acrylic, but that's just gonna frick up my nails, frick up you. Me trying not to curse, but saying words that just make me cringe. <laughs> it's just gonna make my nails look shit. Okay, I'm gonna go eat. All right, I'm ready. I put on a little bit of foundation just cause vibes, I don't know. But I'm just gonna keep on my sweat set and just go. I need to also get myself like a, a pouch that can hold my camera because the handbag, it just slips off my winter jacket all the time, but this camera obviously cannot fit in this pouch. Um, but the camera has a good quality because my phone, I really need to change my phone. I'm actually changing my phone in the next couple weeks because I promised my sister I would give her my phone by December 17th, which is I think next Friday. So <laughs> yeah, I'm, I guess I'm getting a new phone within the next week, big sister things. I'm not even ready to upgrade my phone. I'm just so attached to it because it's like, I'm taking on additional cost of a new phone when I really don't need to, but I promised her, I was supposed to give it to her in September and it's December. So yeah, I'm just gonna give her the phone. Okay, let's go do my nailies. Exposure on that was disgusting. Oh, oh TD. <laughs> Yes, 
guys look at my nails they look so good <laughs> it's funny i'll show you the pinterest picture that i showed the lady she didn't do it exactly like that but like she didn't even use the same shade of green but i like this green more because it's more i don't know pushing me to step out my comfort zone because i was gonna do an olive which is muted because you know shy but you know <laughs> you know what i'm saying you know what i'm saying and now this makes me want to get my hair done and go somewhere fancy but i ain't got nowhere to go <laughs> well perita's birthday um, it's almost 7 o'clock if not 7 o'clock by now. I could have gone to the mall and looked for an outfit But I didn't want to feel rushed. Also, I needed to return this and I left this here It's a shirt I got from dynamite and I bought it that same weekend when I got that purple sheer top from the night when I went to Dinner with my friends, but I bought both of them to see which one I liked and I ended up choosing the purple but this low-key is really nice and I kind of want to keep it and I also wanted to use it for filming my for for like F U R for filming my wine chat one of the wine chats because it's very like festive it's cute here should I try it on and show you guys yeah let me do that okay it doesn't get tied like this but I this is the only way I can do it I couldn't get it tight enough to show you in the back but yeah it's like up here is really tight this knot is not hair and you know baggy sleeves and then the back you would have like a nice big bow right here and it would be cute and this is high-waisted so you can also see like how high up the shirt is but i really like it i just don't need it and my family and i we don't do like christmas dinners like big christmas dinners where everyone dresses up so that's the only other place i'm like oh i could keep it for like a holiday party i have a friends giving or friends must party but it's casual like the theme is casual so i just don't see myself wearing it for now it's cute though and look how it looks nice with the nails so i don't know comment down below what you guys think i wish i looked like a, a baddie right now to give you a better better vibe of the shirt but it's cute you know you guys can see the vision because i have until january to decide if i want it so i've just been kind of like prolonging it because no rush but i like it we'll see if i film with it i'll keep it but let me know what you guys think guys say hi to Janelle. <laughs> What's up? I'm looking like crap because I just got off of work. Period. And I'm watching her vlogs because she has she just posted an hour long video for her birthday that was literally two months ago. <laughs> but you know what? Better late than never. So guys, go and watch Janelle and look how my friend cute. Yeah, go watch. Anyways, I guess it. Something I wish I did more of is spoiling myself. I definitely don't treat myself enough. And like, I don't think you guys realize how the lighting was better in here. I don't think you guys realize how happy it made me to just get my nails done. And I didn't even realize it would make me that happy. It's just really nice to do things for yourself, I guess. So take this as a sign to do something for yourself and it doesn't have to cost money, obviously. Just do something for yourself and don't be like me. I, you know, I talk about this all the time. I really struggle with like self-care and just doing the bare minimum for myself, like showing up for myself. I don't do it and I really need to start doing it more. Janelle and I were planning a trip for next year. We want to travel in the first half of the year. And I'm also in the process of trying to figure out where I want to go for my birthday why did i do that you see what i'm talking about i'm just why am i using my face whatever yeah i'm in the process of planning something for my birthday i made chicken fingers and i want to go to like aruba or something i don't know something that's the vibe i'm feeling though like a girl's trip so stay tuned for some updates on that because i'm gonna be planning it over the next week just to iron out all the details and start sending prices to everyone so they can budget according budget accordingly and all that stuff but yeah very excited and here's the dinner yum yum yum
It is Friday. I am still in London, but I'm going home, but I am still in London. So I can't take myself seriously, y'all. So <laughs> I ended up moving my bus from 6 a.m. this morning to after work. I'm going to leave like near five. Last night, I got into this whole overthinking mode and I managed to convince myself that it was a good idea to take the bus at six because my PA this morning, my personal assessment was supposed to be at 10 a.m. with my boss and the bus wouldn't have gotten to Toronto until like minutes to nine, which I did estimate it would reach early. That's just what it always does. But I was just like, Kiana, no, like that's not a good idea. What if there's like an accident on the highway and you miss your PA and you're going to look unprofessional, which is very true. It's not an irrational thought. It's just that I don't know. And whenever I have thoughts like that, they usually win. <laughs> so yeah, I just ended up pushing the bus better safe than sorry. And it's better if I show up late to hang out my with my friend tonight then showing up late to my pa you know so i'm here i'm gonna leave soon okay can we side note my skin is doing so much better if you guys know if you've been watching the vlogs you know my skin used to be disgusting that's what a consistent skincare routine can do for you because i haven't changed anything except making sure i change my sheets every single week and wash my face every single night and every acne scar that i have on this side of my face that has been since you know my skin has been getting better usually comes up either around my period but mostly not even then mostly if i just don't wash my face especially if i have makeup on at night um so keep up with your skincare routine people like anyways um it's a little side note so anyways the good news is that i don't have to log home with all my work equipment which is what i was gonna have to do and i can just go home and come back on sunday in peace so that's what's going on oh and here's my nails in the daylight <laughs> Ooh. so yeah i'm gonna wrap up the vlog because there ain't nothing going on today we're just gonna sit here and work but if you guys are liked to this video please give it a thumbs up subscribe if you want to if you don't so you're lost, hun, and <laughs> I'll see you guys in the next one. See ya.